All right, everyone, looking at Ethereum really quick here. So Ethereum, if you've been watching the channel here, you know that uh, the market is not bullish until we get over this orange line we have up here. So 25 is the price to be for us to officially be bullish. Until then, until further notice, you know, we're just going to go sideways and down and chop around forever. Uh, so that's our line to beat there. But looking at Ethereum right now, we recently lost a 21-day uh, support here. At 1927, we came down here perfectly and caught the 50. You can see here had a nice little bounce. Got stuck at our uh, 1272 here on this fib at 19 or 1893, and it looks like we're gonna go down even further on Ethereum. So once we lose our 50-day EMA at 1828, uh, your next stop is down here at your 236 at 1719, and then after that, you can see I did draw a box here from your 200-day moving average to this 1680 here. Uh, this is going to be our last ditch, uh, ditch effort to pretty much stay alive and stay bullish on Ethereum. Once we lose our 200-day moving average, uh, we're going down, and the whole market is uh, probably looking bad at that point. And we're not going up, you know, until the happening and all that stuff happens. Um, so yeah, um, let's go ahead and just measure this really quick. So you're sitting right on your 50-day uh, EMA for support. Once we lose that, you're looking at about a seven, seven and a half percent drop to 1719 and if 1719 breaks then we have our box down here anywhere from uh 1650 up to 1680 and you're looking at a potential about 11 12 percent drop down here uh to test that 200 day moving average as support so we'll just leave it at that for now on on ethereum watch these prices to the downside it looks like it wants to come down we are above the 200 day moving average the rsi you can see is below the 50 and the macd has a big gap and it's heading down toward that zero line so everything's telling us that it wants to push lower the Heikinashi candles printing red no shadow uh, so it has a pretty strong trend down at the moment so the moment we break the 50 uh, then you know what prices to watch for here um, but if we move up for some reason uh, you can clearly see we need to get back over this one two seven two and then our two our 21 day moving average which is curled down at the moment so that's not a good sign there. Uh, so I would watch this 19 or 1893 to 1927 um, to get any kind of momentum back on Ethereum and push up even higher. Let me go ahead and just draw a box to the upside here uh, from our 21 to this resistance at 1980. Uh, that's our, our box to beat here. If we get over this box, then we'll start grinding back up and then eventually try to get back up here to this orange line at 25. And then we will know that the whole market is bullish and we can actually start making some money on the way up. So, yeah, we'll leave it at that on Ethereum. Hopefully you guys are having a great day. Uh, I do not know if I'm going to get to any more updates. We are actually heading out to the beach today to go watch the uh, meteor shower tonight. So good times. Uh, hopefully you guys get something out of the content and I'll see you later. Uh, not financial advice. Peace out.